I talked today with NVIDIA CEO Jensen Huang and ARM CEO Simon Seggers on the largest and what I consider the most important semiconductor acquisition ever. While Huang and Seggers are quite different personality-wise, their points of view on our video call about the deal were consistent, well considered and communicated. I am thoroughly impressed at what the two companies could create over the next decade and, unlike other industry analysts, have thought that way since July when rumors started swirling. I'd like to map out the news and my opinions on the news. The following are the deal highlights for the press release. The following are the operating highlights. The NVIDIA ARM deal is not only the largest semiconductor deal by dollar volume at $40 billion, but I believe the one with the most significant impact. I think the deal, fits like a glove, in that ARM plays in areas that NVIDIA does not or isn't that successful, while NVIDIA plays in many places ARM doesn't or isn't that successful. NVIDIA brings incredible capitalization to ARM which, as we have seen since its SoftBank acquisition, ARM has increased its market presence and competitiveness. SoftBank investment has enabled ARM's thrusts in the data center, automotive, IoT and NPU markets. I believe the NVIDIA adder can only make it stronger as long as it sticks with its commitment to let ARM do what they do best, which is creating and licensing IP in a globally neutral way which it is committing. NVIDIA CEO Jensen Huang is excited about the future vision of the combined companies. He told me, we're about to enter a phase where we're going to create an internet that is thousands of times bigger than the internet that we enjoy today. A lot of people don't realize this. And so, so we would like to create a computing company for this age of AI. Software is a key part of the combined company's vision. ARM CEO Simon Seggers framed it well when he told me, we're moving into a world where software doesn't just run in one place. Your application today might run in the cloud, it might run on your phone, and there might be some embedded application running on a device, but I think increasingly and with the rollout of 5 grams and with some of the technologies that Jensen was just talking about this kind of application will become spread across all of those places. Delivering that and managing that there's a huge task to do. And it all requires a computing architecture that can scale from the tiniest sets all the way up to the biggest supercomputer, and we can address that. The new NVIDIA ARM combination now plays in nearly every market segment in the data center, edge of data center, personal computers, smartphones and the IoT. My imagination runs wild with the possibilities of, Huang told me that first thing that the combined company will do is to, bring NVIDIA technology through ARM's vast network.